the worst golfer has officially arrived on the scene. I'm actually at Fraser Glen. Shout out to them for actually having me out here. Um, uh, bar here is 62, so uh, the goal is to shoot as close as I possibly can. It'll be a two part video because we're going to do all 18 holes. Let's get into it. First swing of the channel. I swear, this here is going to dictate how the channel goes. It's either going to be great or we're going to fail. shot I'll take it so I've only been playing golf for realistically seven months now so it hasn't been too long and I'll be honest I'm absolutely addicted to the sport it's literally in the minus right now there is a there's a snowstorm coming today and I literally said to myself when I woke up this morning, there's a little bit of time before the snow falls, so I'm gonna try and go play around. And that's exactly what we're doing. I don't know the range. I know the range finder and the wedges for me are frightening. I'm hoping I can put this. It's on there. It's on the green. I don't know how to read the greens, which is also a tough part in this, but we're gonna give it a shot here. Ooh, for the sake of par. Let's go. <laughs> I cannot believe that I hit par on the first hole. Holy, this is actually an unreal start. I have never, ever had a start like this. Ever. I'm usually chunking my way down the golf course. But you know what? I gotta put on a good performance for y'all. You know what I'm saying? It says 161 yards par three. I think it's a little less because where my camera is, where is where it usually is. I think I'm gonna swing an eight iron on this. Yeah. yeah, that's what we're used to right there. That is it. <laughs> I don't know what happened, but it is what it is. I got too excited after the first hole. I mean, to save par from here would be phenomenal, but. I, I doubt that's gonna happen, I'll be honest. Because my wedge game is absolutely horrid. I suck at wedges. Try to get it anywhere on the green. Hopefully close to the hole. Oh, that's not gonna be it. Look at this performance right here, y'all. I gave you a one good hole. <laughs> Look at this. <laughs> Thing went nowhere. I've honestly got the best putter shot chamber as you can see it's literally just a piece of metal attached to another piece of metal I hope it's close enough so I can put this in for a bogey fuck it's still out That is a double for me. Double bogey. That's usually my playground. Double bogey is where I usually live. <laughs> I'm lost on the course. This is my like second time playing this course. Hole number three. We're looking at about 117 yards. Um, I'm gonna take out a pitching wedge. And I'm gonna try to do the most I possibly can. Oh my God. I mean, I guess this is what golf is really all about. I'm probably like literally one of the worst fucking golfers on the damn platform. But I will say this. I need to fucking start hitting some shots here. Hopefully I can put this in a little tighter than I did last time. 
threes are just not my friend right now. I've got the daily driver here. Goal number four in the par four, 319 yards. Hopefully I can get a par on this, honestly. I, that's all I'm looking for. I don't know how to drive, so it doesn't help. I fucking lost my scorecard. It's not good. Okay. I think that's good. I literally hit it into this tree. Horrible. We made it. We made it. We made it. Hit one wedge shot onto the green. It's all we're off. Right there. It's short, man. Fuck! Uh, shot number four. I have no faith in my wedge game whatsoever to get this up and down. So I'm going with the Willie Special. Sit. Oh, that's dirty. I swear, man, sometimes I feel because like I've only been playing for, like I said, seven months now. Sometimes I put way too much pressure on myself to like, be like, oh no, these need to be. Like I'm playing I'm playing a pretty good round of golf right now. I feel like it's gonna go right to left, but I have no idea. Honestly like oh really green. I didn't hit it. On a double bogey train. Goal number five, 94 yards, par three. Oh, that's long. Fuck. I will say though, that was the best contact I've had all day today with an iron and that excites me. I just feel like, you know, when you spend so much time at the driving range, like it's great and all, but you don't really know how good you are or like if it translates once you get it on the golf course, like that's just the toughest thing. Cause like you can literally spend hours on a driving range but I feel like every time I come to the course, it's a whole different ball game, every time. My ball is sitting over there. That's a hole, ball, hole. That is another bogey. Hole number six, 262 yards, par four. Um, <laughs> I don't know if the driver is the play, but we are gonna try to drive the green. I feel like I really piped that, but I just don't know where the fuck it went. 
Um, I couldn't find my ball. I reviewed it on the camera and it flew out. Well, it flew out this way. I should say that. Oh, hi. Nice to meet you too. So, I had to take a drop. Oh, yay, yay. That's over the green. That was a nice shot. But I'm just falling apart right now. Holy shit. I'm making solid contact. That's all I kind of can ask for right now. Because after thinning so many damn shots, it hasn't been fun. This is to save par. That's for my bogey. I don't even know what's above a double bogey because that's usually when I stop counting. But I shot three shots over par. How's that? I think I'm 11 over par right now. Um, and, and this is only hole seven, so. Par three, 153 yards. Let's see if I can get some of this mojo back here. It got there just slightly right of the green. We are short and to the right. Oh my God. I swear to God, man, this, this chipping is frustrating. Holy fuck. I'm trying not to slow play down either, but when you're just hot ass, there's absolutely nothing that you can do to prevent that. At this point, I'm just trying to walk out of here with a bogey and onto the net. Left it short again. Fuck. Too much respect for these greens. It's killing me. Too much respect. I mean, can we just acknowledge just how beautiful this course is? We got 162 yards, another par three, so. I really need to get I need to I need to get a par. Oh that's not good. We are in trouble. It's literally in some trees as we speak. Oh is this it? Did the trees save me? Oh, wow. They saved me. Okay. Oh, yeah. We're going to light that one. We are going to light that one. So I think I'm at a plus 13 at the moment. If I'm at a plus 13, this is tough. <laughs> I'm actually closer than I expected, to be honest. I thought I was going to be further out. I just need to... Just sink this one in. Too much respect for the greens. <laughs> Another part four. 302 yards. I 
I think that might be good. I believe it's up on the left somewhere. One thing's for sure is that when I said that the worst golfer has arrived, literally the worst golfer has arrived. So if they can put this in nice and tight, that'd be awesome. Not awesome. Trying to pull out the Willie special. That will do. Another bogey. After the calculations of the front nine, I shot a 47. Uh, par is 31. So I shot 16 over. Not bad. Thanks for watching. Hope you guys enjoyed it. Uh, like I said, I was in line when I said the worst golfer has officially arrived on YouTube. I have. I was in line. I'll catch you guys in the next one.